how has this year been for you? How would you describe it? I mean, you find a way to, you're almost a point per game, and you've been in and out of the lineup battling injuries. I mean, it's been yeah, I mean, it's been it's been really good when I've been playing. Obviously, you never want to be injured, and uh, you want to play as many games as you can in the year. So that part of the year has been disappointing. But when I've been healthy and in the lineup, uh, you know, I felt great, and then we've had success, so it's been nice. How have you found uh, taking on the role of being the, the number one center uh, for this team? Uh, I mean, it's been a few years now, so uh, it's been fun. I think uh, me, JVR, and Phil have gained a lot of chemistry together, and um, you know we've been successful as a line uh, each and every year, and I think we're all on pace for career years this year. Um, so it's it's been a good year, and hopefully we can just keep keep improving. And you know it's going to be a huge month and a bit here uh, for our team, and you know we're going to have to elevate our game even more. What does it say about the team when you think back now, you know, when you were out, when others were out, uh, how the club's been able to get to this point and, you know, be in the picture? Yeah, unbelievable. I mean, I think we have a lot of depth. Uh, the guys that have come in and stepped in and filled roles have done a, a great job. Um, you know, we've had quite a few injuries as a group this year. It's obviously not an excuse or anything like that, but all the young guys and other guys that have come in and stepped in, like I said, have done excellent, and uh, I think that's helped us huge this year. Have you talked to Bill since he came back? Yeah, yeah, no, he got back yesterday, so uh, we were just hanging out. He's pretty tired, uh, long travel day yesterday, so yeah, he had fun and obviously a little disappointed, but uh, all in all, he had a good time. Did you chirp him all after that game? <laughs> no, I didn't, I didn't. I kind of just wanted to get, get his feel on how it was over there and get some stories and stuff like that, so. Uh, yeah, he had a good time. It sounds like a time difference in the, all the amount he played. Caught up with him. Well, yeah, I think they've what played seven games in nine or ten days or whatever, and then uh, yes, after your last game. and then yesterday they traveled. Um, they traveled all the way back, so he was, he was pretty tired. I think that's a lot of time in the air and the time change and a, and a ton of hockey when you know most of us were just kind of relaxing in tropical weather. So yeah, he's pretty tired. I think. <laughs> What does it do, Tyler, for forwards, especially when you have some consistency in, in line mates? I mean, obviously, when the three of you have been together all year, it's a staple, but just looking beyond your line in particular. Yeah, I mean, I think chemistry is huge. I think Nazi and Loops have gained a ton of chemistry together over the uh, the course of a couple of years here, and I think Clarkie's moved in there and, and starting to find that. I mean, that's one of the hardest things, I think, to find. I think... You know, you can take three guys and put them together, and not everyone's going to work the same. So I think chemistry is the most important thing uh, that's going to you know, get you going. Tyler, has the break helped you? Well, I mean, it's hard to say. We haven't played another game yet. No, but so. I mean physically. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, for a guy like me that's small stature and uh, lose a little weight during the season, definitely any time off to, and with the injuries I've had, when you can get some time off to, you know, rehab and, and rest, it'll, it'll help me for sure.